Hello everyone. I am Ms. Geeta Ranjani, Aptitude and Reasoning Faculty from Offices IAS Academy. Welcome to the first video on the CSAT video series. In this series, we are going to discuss the aptitude and reasoning questions from the CSAT 2023 previous year question paper. Let's get into the first question. So question number one, it's given a three digit number ABC on multiplication with D gives three seven double D. Here we need to consider this three seven double D is a four digit number. So here units place, tens place, hundreds place and thousands place. In this thousand place, three is situated and hundreds place, seven is located and this D and these two Ds are accommodated in the units and tens digit. So it is a four digit number and given condition where A, B, C and D are different non-zero digits, what is the value of A plus B plus C given? So first thing, this question is from the topic number system. In that number system, what is the subtopic? It is just based on the arithmetical operations. One of the arithmetical operation, multiplication based number system problem is given. So here ABC is a three digit number, units, tens, hundred or the position of ABC. Here three digit number ABC while multiplication with D we are getting a result of this three seven double D. So what is the meaning ABC into D the result is three seven double D. First number ABC while the second number D we got the result. Technically how to call the first number second number the result are. 3, 7, double D is the result. We will be calling this as product. And A, B, C, the first number is called as the multiplicand. And the D is called as the multiplier. So here, when a multiplicand is multiplied with a multiplier, we are getting the product. This is what? A normal multiplication process. The same can be decoded like this when the product 3, 7, double D divided by this multiplier D, we will be getting A, B, C as the result. So, we can decode the first multiplication as division. So, in this we need to find what is D. If we find D, then we can find A, B, C. They are asking us to find the A plus B plus C. So D is what actually? Just now we discussed D is situated in the units place. Another D is at the tens place. Seven is at the hundreds place and three is at the thousands place. Which means D is a single digit number. So that we need to consider any single digit number here. We want to substitute that number with D where we can get this ABC. Now what is the procedure? How to approach this problem in the examination? Let's see. Now let's understand some important points from this question. So ABC is a three digit number given. So we want to take this as a non-decimal number. Non-decimal number means which does not have any decimal points or decimal numbers like that. So here this is what actually a natural number. So when a four digit number divided by T, D, we are getting ABC which means the 3, 7, double D is divisible 
by d this is the first thing we want to understand the first point 37 double d is divisible by d so that we got the product as a non decimal number then the second thing we can get from this is while dividing with d we are getting the result as a three digit number so we can mark the two the result is a three digit number then the third point we can take a b c are different non zero digits so a b c we can take they are different digits and non zero digits that's the point now we can use the hidden trial method so what is the best approach to crack this question is hidden trial in this hidden trial method we can use single digit numbers for d initially given d is a single digit number so what are the single digit numbers from 0 to 9 also the condition given a b c d are non zero digits so i can take except 0 what are the single digit numbers so up to 9 6 7 8 9 so these are the values you can substitute for d so first thing i am considering when d is 1 let me take d is 1 this 3 7 double d means double 1 i want to put by 1 what will happen while 3 7 double 1 divided by 1 we will be getting 3 7 double 1 as the answer so we want a b c is a three digit number here four digit we got so we can eliminate this option for d the second trial method here we can substitute the value for d is 2 So three seven double two divided by two. What is the result? One time two here. One time two balance one. Eight time two sixteen balance one. Six time two is twelve. Here one time two is two. So I got four digit as my answer. But we need A B C equal to three digit number. So option two also eliminated. Let me take. the third option with d3 so here 3 7 3 3 divided by 3 so what is the first condition 3 7 dd is divisible by d which means this number must to be divisible by 3 let's check the divisibility test with number 3 what is the divisibility rule for number 3 sum of the digits must be divisible by 3 so this is the first condition so let me take the sum of the digits in the numerator 3 plus 7 10 10 plus 3 13 13 plus 3 16 i will be getting so 16 is not a multiple of 3 so we can eliminate this condition because the first condition is not satisfied next we can move with the fourth option let me take d is 4 so in this case 3 7 double 4 divided by 4 what is the result going to be so 9 time 4 is 36 carry over 1 so your 3 time 4 is 12 carry over 2 6 time 4 is 24 yes the first condition that number is divisible by 4 second condition the result we are getting is a three digit number third condition a b c or different non zero digits yes this is a this is b this is c all the three conditions are satisfied we can take d is 4 and a b c are 9 3 6 respectively so the question is asking you to find what is a plus b plus c a 9 b 3 c 6 9 plus 3 12 12 plus 6 18 so the answer is option a 18 so this is the way of approach to solve it the next thing 
the same question if you know the concept how quickly you can answer let's see so the question is giving a three digit number abc on multiplication with d gives 37 d where abc and d are different non zero digits so abc into d is 37 dd means when 37 dd divided by d will give you abc as the result from this point we can take the points 37 dd is a four digit number after dividing with d it gives a natural number which means d is divisible in that number completely d is divisible in that number second point a b c is a three digit number so we can take the result must be a three digit number then third point a b c are different digits now we can use the hit and trial method to crack it first thing 3711 divided by 1 So one is divisible in that yes one is divisible in every number but the second condition the result must be of three digit number so three seven double one while divided by one what you will get obviously a four digit number second condition not satisfied so we can eliminate this then second number I am substituting three seven double two divided by two so here one time two here one time two like that you can take otherwise you can also check in this way without doing the direct division first number second number third number fourth number so in this all the four digits are greater than or equal to 2 yes 3 is greater than 2 7 is greater than 2 2 is equal to 2 this 2 is also equal to 2 so in this case what is the understanding we will be getting a four digit number as the result as every digits are greater than 2 so you can skip at this stage now the third testing 3733 divided by 3 what is the first condition d is divisible in that so 3 must be divisible in this So three plus seven plus three plus three. Applying the divisibility rule of three, the sum of digits must be the multiple of three. Let's check three plus seven plus three plus three. Sixteen I get. So sixteen is not the multiple of three. So you can reject this. Next one three seven double four divided by four. Yes, here we can check nine times four is thirty six and balance one. Yes, this stage I confirm. i will be getting result in three digits because two digits 3 and 7 together give nine times so i can consider balance 3 time 4 is 12 here carry over to 6 time 4 is 24 so 936 whether it is satisfying all the conditions or not just check d is divisible s yes. result three digit number s yes. a b c all are different digits s yes, all are different digits so my answer is A plus B plus C equal to eighteen. So that's all. So in this video, we have covered one question with the concept: what is the best approach and how to solve it quickly if you know that approach. Now, another segment. In this segment, I am going to give you a question. You can solve this question based on the previous pattern. and just register your answer in the comment section a four digit number a9 a9 so it's of the form a9 a9 on multiplication with c gives 9c 9c so here values are given in between a a means both the a having same value and here both the c are having same values where a b c are different non zero digits What is the value of a plus c? Solve this question using the previous pattern and register your answer in the comment section. And in the next video, I will be meeting you with some other interesting questions with the best approach. Thanks for watching.